All right, folks, I am here with the group that started the Facebook group, Baskets for Kids and Teens in Gloucester and Rockport. We are joined by Melanie, Susan, Robin, and Amanda. How are you, ladies? Good. Hi. Great, how are you? And there are various children and animals and all these backgrounds. <laughs> <laughs> So right off the bat, we want to um, congratulate you for starting this group. For the for those who don't know uh, what this group is, can someone please explain that and how the idea came about? Want me to go? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go. sounds good, All Melanie. Right. So I started this group. Um, I was on, they has like an adult page for like whining adults. And a lot of people wanted something for their kids, but they didn't want to have it on that page where alcohol was involved. Um, and a lot of parents didn't quite know how to make a group. So I decided to start it up and, you know, bring on some people to help because I knew there was no way I could do it on my own still working full time. Uh, so I started the group and it has taken off to about, I want to say there's like 440 members. Yeah. And we've been getting baskets out to kids in Gloucester and in Rockport from ages baby all the way to 20. So now, what age? I'm sorry. Um, it yeah. starts from eight until twenty. Wow, nice. And so, why did you feel the need to um to to do this? Why did you feel like was that age group? Do you feel neglected, or or would you just want to do something good for the community? Um, just doing something good for the community, and also like I feel like kids are just going through a very hard time right now, just being stuck at home can't really see their friends, can't go to school. So it's just, I know a lot of kids, I have one at home and they're just going through a hard time right now with, you know, the school quarantine thing. So Robin, let me ask you, what are you putting into these baskets? So anything and everything. Some, some people are requesting certain things, but um, just toys, snacks, uh, makeup for older kids, um, lots of outdoor stuff, outdoor um, sports, footballs, um, jump ropes, you name it. Um, we put it together and I, I'm so proud to be part of this group. It's like um, Melanie said, the, um, I, as I'm a school teacher in middle school and I see firsthand um, how hard it is for these kids. And I have two of my own and I just want to put a smile on their faces. and. And I love it. It's just, it's given my kids and me joy just to be part of this and deliver these baskets. So. I have a question. Do the baskets arrive as a surprise? Are the kids surprised to get them? Yes. Yes. Nice. Yeah. So we try to be yeah. and like run out. <laughs> Sometimes they're outside and I'm like, you know, I feel like the little Santa Claus. <laughs> Amanda, how, do you know how many baskets you've done so far? I'm not sure. Um, you'd have to ask one of the other girls that. I kind of keep track of the spreadsheet and add kids to them. Um, I've had a couple of the girls will drop stuff off to me, and I put some baskets together, and they go out and deliver them for me. Well, for us, I should say, because um, I have little ones, so I can't get to the store. Uh, I don't want to bring my kids to the store. But they've also had fun helping me. My little guy destroys them on me once I get them together. But <laughs> it's been fun. I'm not sure how many we've put together. Um, Melanie might be better for that question. Uh, I would say probably close to about 120 at least. Wow. Yeah. I think a lot more than that because I've put together over 100 myself. Uh, All right, then. I know I've done 60, so. Yeah. Yeah, and I did 20 last night and 18 last time, so. I'll probably at least at 200 then. <laughs> 250. Are the parents mm -hmm. finding you on Facebook and they are suggesting names? Is that how that works? Um, the best way to do it, so I have the page as hidden just because there's so much children's information on there. They don't want to get out. So the best way is to contact or add one of the four of us as a friend. And then we can just add you into the group once you're our friend. And that's when all the... Um, the children's names are identified, their addresses, their ages, and you make the connections, right? Correct. That's uh, Susan, are you actually on a delivery right now? Yeah, she is. I am. <laughs> <laughs> that is currently what I'm doing. I'm giving my daughter direction to house it. That's funny. So have any of you gone any, uh, 
real-time <laughs> reactions um, from any of these people or their families yet? We have gotten we, a lot of pictures. Oh, yeah. Or, and the, I've gotten a video a few times from some little kids getting them. Why are you taking this away from him? And so, Robin, how about, is there any idea of how long you'll be doing this? Is this through, maybe it's just sort of like through the school year thing, or is this just going to kind of go and go? I'm just going to go with the flow. If it continues on in the summer, I I'm good with it. And I don't know. I know um, summer school is going to be remote. And um, I don't know about the fall at this point in time. So they still might need this. Um, in September, so we'll see how it goes. So now, if people want to contribute to these baskets in any way, how can they go about doing that? So you could either drop off items to one of us, or like we also have like get snack food, um, or you can do Venmo. Me and Robin both have Venmo. Um, my Venmo is Melanie Dash Wall, so it's easy to find. And Robin, what is yours? It's Robin Dash Cosma. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just our names. I'm just jotting that down. Cool. Awesome. Well, anything else you want to share with the community about your efforts? We also have um, a wish list um, through Amazon. So if any, I've been getting deliveries all day from people um, that have bought from our wish list. So just want to say thank you to everyone on the group as well. Um, and I like, this is in my happy point because <laughs> we're yeah. not so happy. <laughs> so. Well, we think it's a, an awesome idea, and uh, we raise a glass for the four of you and everyone else who's been involved in baskets for kids and teens and Gloucester uh, and in Gloucester. It's a private group. We can find one of these ladies if you want to get in and contribute in some way. And we'll put these links up for everyone too. So, uh, Melanie, Susan, Rob, and Amanda, thanks so much. Thank and, you. Uh, we appreciate all you're doing and have a great rest of the week. And uh, we hope the group just keeps flourishing. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. Take care. Bye. Bye.